that's nice. The mornings are quiet for Mark and Barbara Smith. That's a midweek oh. with Nancy Cohen's thing. Okay. But these quiet times at the kitchen table give no hint to the life Mark has led. Well, I was a student at Denton High School in the late 60s. In fact, if I had graduated, it would have been the class of 1968. He didn't graduate because he was chasing rock star dreams. We made a record and we were frequent visitors in a local TV show, and it was just an exciting time. Eventually, those rock dreams faded, and Mark headed back to school. First as an art student, and later a professor. He also managed to become a successful working artist, with pieces hung in many of the finest galleries in America. I got to walk in and see my painting next to Gustave Courbet and Picasso and Pissarro, and I thought, well, this is, this is kind of neat. I think, in retrospect, I was very naive about what the future would hold but I never failed to work as hard as I could, and I was sort of tenacious, and I think maybe tenacity trumped all other required skill sets, and I had lots of tenacity. That tenacity has led to quite a career, but through it all, Mark never forgot home, the place that in one way or another made his amazing life possible. I got to visit the new Denton High School, the new campus, that was, we positively blown away. First impression that I got was walking into the main space and looking at the students sitting in the beautiful glass atrium, having coffee, eating their lunch, talking. It w there were so many smiling faces and there was so much positive energy. Everybody seemed welcomed. They seemed encouraged. They seemed to be flourishing and it literally filled my heart with an immediate sense of this is the place. For the Smiths, that meant this is the place to give an amazing gift. They created a $1 million trust for the fine arts students and teachers of Denton ISD. A trust that will provide special experiences for our fine arts community that simply could not happen otherwise. Like most districts, uh, we plan for our budget to provide the supplies and equipment that we need to keep our facilities going, to, to transport them. But Mark's gift is going to provide the potential for opportunities of, that we can only dream of. Uh, it, I think it's just going to be a game changer for our students and teachers. A game changer that will celebrate the arts in a way that's never happened before in Denton ISD. And it's happening because of the long winding road the Smiths took that eventually led back home. We are absolutely ecstatic. We're happy, we're, we're, uh, we're confident, we uh, feel in our own way like we're fulfilling part of our dream. He's motivated by opening doors for kids and uh, patting teachers on the back and he wants people to know what's going on in Denton ISD. This is the right place, the right time, and we're beyond happy that we found the SID Fine Arts Program, and we feel like this is our, kind of our new home.